Welcome back everybody. Today we have Road to Heaven Stands Unleashed. This game is finally out and I did a video about a week or so ago uh, about like pre-release and the game was pretty fun and guys it also this is what I'm very oh no I guess I disabled the arrows but there was you could go across the menu and it did show a steel ball run that's very exciting I cannot wait till this happens this is a huge underrated Jojo game and I suggest you go play it okay guys so let's go ahead and hop in so they have added a, added a couple things since the uh, game has released in a week a lot of it's been bug fixes but they added a new quest and we're just going to check out some more stands and have some fun with this, guys. So make sure, if you end up liking the video, to hit the subscribe button and enable notifications. And don't forget to use star code Atlas Zero when purchasing Robux. So, uh, first of all, we're going to check out one of the first stands that we have in our inventory. We have stand storage. Uh, we have a couple of different things. And then we'll actually use some Rokas and Arrows as the devs. Oh, I thought I had more than that. Okay. I might have to give them to, give them to me again. But, uh, yeah. Some Rokas and Arrows, we might just use what we got right here, that's three, that's enough. We'll use these Rokas and Arrows guys uh, to see what we can actually get from them, so that'll be pretty neat. But we also have some more stands to check out in stand storage, as you can see. And we'll check out all the quests. So first of all, we have King Crimson. This is the one that we have out right now, so let's look at the Trello to see the actual moveset. So first of all, uh, let's come over to this thug, there's a thug or something around here. Gosh, I guess they just keep beating the mess out of them. Look, they got them, done got them all over there. Golly. Okay, so now that time has stopped, let's keep rolling. Uh, we have E for ground slam. Oh, oh, so we have some standoff moves. This is a standoff move. Okay, ground slam. Okay, that's actually pretty neat. That did a lot of damage, okay? Then we have, uh, I'm assuming this, this E is going to be our barrage. Yes. And then R is scissor throw? Wait, wait, we're going to throw scissors? Okay, that was actually pretty neat. Okay, and then with oh wait no scissors throw is stand off. Okay, there's our let's do scissors though because that was shoulder chop. So scissors throw. Okay, I don't know if the mesh was glitched out or whatnot, but we still threw scissors so that was neat or something. Um, so the other one was shoulder chop. So if we do T, that should be impale. Let's impale this dude, Bruh, What the heck? Okay, and then we have. The Y is Epitaph. So, uh, I think I'm saying it right. Probably not, though. What the? Holy smokes, Batman. That was crazy. And then we have, um, B is Chop Combo. Chop Combo, bruh. And then we have G for Time Erase. Ooh, I wonder how to really do this one well. Uh, let's just kind of hit this thug, get him away from us. And then let's do, like, a G. T wait, 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 wait. What happened? I thought we were able to do Time Erase somehow. Uh, maybe because there's universal cooldown. I'm not too sure about it. That might be why, so we might not be checking out Time Erase. It just depends on if by the time, you know, we're done with this dude, we got our universal cooldown back. Oh, bruh. I hope that dude didn't keep me from doing Time Erase. Yeah, I think that's probably the issue. So we got G and plus J. So we have like double. So that actually, did that one not work? G plus J? I don't know. We might have some moves that aren't 100%. Oh, Oh, time and race and blood thrower disabled. I feel retarded. Okay. Anyways, that is basically King Crimson, but we want to check out some more stands and moves at the same time. So let's get, uh, I mean, stands and quest out at the same time. So we got a storage. Let's get weather report out. He said weather report's actually pretty neat. So I'm going to pull it up on the trailer here and we have some other good moves. But first of all, I want to go to the other quest area. Now, weather report actually looks pretty pretty neat now we don't have a pose with the stand but i do like the model that dude is sick so let's see what uh wait did my pose yeah my pose kind of got me stuck <laughs> let's see what koichi wants to tell us i mean we are in morio uh sure thing thugs robbing the stores let's put it into into this bro this might just come and clean out all the thugs i mean what the heck these thugs are where are they at we're just gonna have to okay they're all outside last time they were inside the shop so first of all, we have Cyclone Barrage, nice little barrage, and then we have Air Punch, which should be our, our move, it's like a heavy punch, and then T is Icicles, okay, I'll hit you, I don't care, we'll throw our Icicles out, what the heck, there's Luffy coming at us, and then Y should be Water Manipulation, and that one looks like, uh, is that kind of, I don't know what it does, I'm, okay, that creates clouds around him and freezes the water inside them, then he will proceed to shoot Icicles at the opponent. Did we do this wrong? I don't I don't really know. Uh, but 
Let's see. Clouds freeze within liquid will appear around the user and it goes as far as 10 studs. A players to get near weather port. Vaporous gust flood players' bodies with water takes 5 damage. Okay. 5 damage per second in the last 6 seconds. Okay, so it's really not... That, that's what that one is. So that is, what, water manipulation? If we do that again, will he get hurt? Uh, I don't see any damage happening right now. I don't know. So next we have Thunderstorm. Let's do this Thunderstorm. Bruh, get it. Get it, get it, get it. Get it. You're supposed to be Thunderstorm. Uh, I don't know if Weather Report's broke or what. Let's go with Atmospheric Layers. Basically, this thing... Uh, creates atmosphere layers to increase air resistance to the point where he can deflect projectiles. Okay, that's pretty neat. And then we have Cloud Suit, which is B. What? Hold on. Dude, that is just like... Oh, that is so cool. That is neat. I love the Cloud Suit. And then we got Poisonous Rain. Poisonous Frog Rain? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I do remember that. And I don't know if it's disabled or just not working. But it's definitely not... It's definitely not doing anything when I press the key. But still, that's a pretty neat move. So there's still some things that need to complete on this game. But hey, I, th I really like it to begin with. And I cannot wait for the Steel Ball run. So let's get another stand. We'll get uh, Killer Queen out. And I, you know what? I said that we would... I said that we would look at some other... This is Killer Queen. But I said we would actually pull some arrows. See what we can get. Let's. So let's... Actually, eat some eat a Roka right now, and then let's see if we can get something by using our arrow. All right, let's look at the arrow animation. Nice arrow animation, and we ended up getting weather report. Okay, and then we will Roka this thing again. And what are we gonna get? Will we get something good? Can we get Star Crusher. Okay, we got White Snake. So we already had White Snake. Nothing too special. So we did two arrow pulls and. Uh, I guess we can look at why I want to look at Killer Queen though while we're at it while we're here. I, I I want Killer Queen. I just I just like the way this model looks. Like, check this thing out. That thing's pretty neat. I mean, it's not. I like the 3D effects they put on it. That's they they got some pretty neat models in this game, guys. Not gonna lie. Okay, so first of all, we got Shiba Barrage. So what we're gonna do is, uh, there is I don't know who the heck this dude is, but. If you go behind the police station, this is one of the other quests that they added. And if you look, there are some chaos. Look at all the freaking... Look, we'll, we'll come here. Wait, 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 wait. Look, there are the, the NPCs are all fighting each other. They're fighting. Okay. So now we have to hop in on their fight. Uh, with the, our barrage, we'll start off. Uh, the Shiba barrage. Hopefully they don't all just come after me at once. And then you got a heavy punch. Gosh, we knocked them all back. Okay. And then coin toss. Let's see. Uh, oh gosh, they're all coming at me. And then, okay, that actually worked pretty well. Uh, whoo, no, I need, I need my heavy punch. Or they're just gonna wreck me. Okay, uh, we gotta get out of this. Okay, uh, first bomb. Let's go with our first bomb. Throw that out there. Oh, bomb plant. And then you have to detonate it. I bet. Okay, I forgot. That's how Killer Queen works. There's so many. Um, I'm not used to how Killer Queen works in a lot of these games I don't really use Killer Queen much in JoJo games but I think oh gosh they're hopping it okay let's try first bomb uh on this dude which should be why wait did we get him or was that our coin toss I think I hit T on accident hey these dudes are just coming after me so we go why we didn't get it off so let's get let's get our heavy punch off get these dudes back then we'll do our Y move and then we planted it, and then we detonate it. Okay, there we go. Then we got Stray Cat, which is our U move. Okay, that was actually the Cat Bubble. Okay, that's I do like how they put that in there. So let's go. We gotta, we gotta defeat these dudes because they just coming right at me and they don't stop. It was a whole bunch of them. Uh, so the Stray Cat. Let's just hit this dude with our Stray Cat. This is Luffy. Bubble Bomb. Wait, wait. Did I miss something? Or did something not go right? I don't know. Bites the dust is disabled, but we have sheer heart attack. Let's throw this down. You need an arrow? We got sheer heart attack. We should sheer heart. You wanted an arrow and you got sheer heart attack instead. And then G chop. A G is chop attack. So let's go. That thing. Oh, oh gosh. It's running after him. It's running after him. Oh no, it's going to go after this dude now. 
Okay, that's actually pretty neat. I like how that happened. Okay. Oh gosh. So let's do our G -ch our chop attack move as soon as we get to somebody. Bro, I was just want to chop you. That's all. I just want to. Where's arrows? Uh, check this out. Check that out. Boom. I was gonna detonate it. Did I miss it? Bomb plant. I just detonated. Okay. Let's do our our coin flip. Get out of here, thug. Uh, get get. Wait wait wait. We have to G chop on him. Let's go with... Oh, no. I'm running. I'm, I say I'm running. Go. Chop attack. Go. Get out of here, boy. All right. So next we have... What, what do we want to use next? We have White Snake. We can use them. All right. So White Snake has these moves where uh, you can actually steal a stain steal. So we got Barrage for White Snake. Uh, let's just go to the... Go get this slug right here. Barrage. Normal Barrage. And we have Heavy Punch. They said this, assume we have gunfire. Okay, uh, oh, that's pretty neat. And then stand steel, which actually just, I don't, let's just hit this. We gotta, we gotta hit somebody that actually has a stand. So I guess we can do disc combo. Well, I was gonna do disc combo on the thug, but let's do stand steel. So it really just kind of disables our stand for a second. And then we have the disc combo. Not bad, not bad. And then we have Dissolving Goo. So what happens if we... Do they get... I don't really think they get ca caught in it. Because the dude didn't get stuck. But it did damage him. So then we have Sleep Attack. White Snake will make anyone... 10 studs near him. Sleep Attack. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It should have been 10 studs. Maybe I wasn't close enough for it to work. I don't know. But B is autopilot. White Snake can walk... Oh... Okay, watch this. Wait, wait, autopilot? Maybe it's just a, oh, it's delayed. So, it's a delayed attack. Uh, I don't really know when that's gonna start working, but it looks like it's not working for me yet. So I'm not too sure about it. Sleep attack. Uh, Yeah, sleep attack didn't work for me. I, I'm assuming it's just bugged out or something. Nothing too, too crazy. Uh, but as far as, I think we checked out just about every stand in the game except, except for Crazy Diamond, The World, and Star Crusher. Okay, uh, Star Platinum. Okay, now we have The World. So The World's always, what the heck? The World's always a good stand to use and always a good stand to check out. I don't know why it put me in the bushes over here, but hey. Um, now The World, I don't know if they, if they fixed World World yet, but we're going to try that out. So first of all, we have the barrage then we have our heavy punch then we have t knives bruh wait did they just not get thrown or something uh what trade is my star okay it did throw i guess there's some there's just a lag in the server then we have ground slam and then we have time stop which i think time stop is a cool has a cooldown a universal cooldown probably then we have b roll roller i wonder i want to use roll roller on this dude Oh, I'm gonna use it on Thug, but it might be dis- Oh, it's disabled for now. Okay. So, but we have a rage mode. Uh, once we get a certain amount of our health's like 30%, like under 30%, it's- We can go into rage mode, and then we can use- Well, we could- We don't really have a special use, but I think Star- Star Platinum has a beatdown that you can use on it. But, guys, I had fun checking this out. If you liked the video, make sure you subscribe. Oh, the world has a pose. And it has a music with it. That's pretty neat. But guys, if you liked the video, make sure you subscribe and enable notifications. Uh, I'm expecting a lot more from this game. And when we get another big update, I will check it out, okay? So this game's released. Go play it. Go check it out. I think it's pretty fun. They'll be getting PvP going pretty soon. So guys, thanks for watching and God bless you.